friends welcome back to my channel i'm christine of side street market and today i have a little reseller friend mail haul for you these are a couple of items um i bought gosh a while ago from my friend michelle at newman's cupboard and she also sent me a little friend mail so i thought i would do a little unboxing for you these items were from she did a year-end clearance sale i think gosh it might have been november and i'm just getting to open them so let's see what's in the first package so first up we have this super she wraps things so cutely and I think now I remember I had bought a record from her yep and so I will be using this in my decor next year because it is a cute little Christmas can you guys see that with the glare tis the season I also have a record player so I will probably actually listen to this as well the cats are going to love that tissue paper, Michelle. The chappy's going to be all over that. Do you hear what I hear? Silver bells, Christmas angel. Yeah, so this is this will be cute for when we're opening presents Christmas morning next year. I'll be sure to play that on our record player. And so, like I was saying, I bought these items from Michelle's live sale, her end of the year clearance sale she had. And I'll be sure to link her channel and all of her information below because she does do live sales. Um, I'm not sure. I think she's going to be doing them every month. Just I'm don't, not sure of the time. So just make sure you're subscribed and checking out her channel. And then we have another cute box of goodies. And we'll see if I can remember what I got in here. Again, she always does such a beautiful job of packing. So let's see. This is her. She always does these really cute little package toppers. And I did bring my scissors because just in case there's a bit of tape on things. So we got our little package topper bag. Oh, it's a little Fitz and Floyd Christmas party. Save the date card. That's cute. I can use that in display next year. And then she always sends a cute little recipe card. And Chappie found some of the tissue paper. And here's her card, Newton's Cupboard. So thank you, Michelle. Oh my goodness. Then there's little tags. There's like, it feels like a little fabric coaster. That's cute. Another tag. And then this cracks me up because I totally had these cards when I was a kid. I remember this deck from when I was a child. And then a little trivia card. So those are all the fun little package toppers. So let's get into seeing what I actually bought. I'm just gonna go ahead and snip the ribbon off real quick to expedite things a little. I used to do these sort of videos as Friday morning coffees, but sometimes I don't know how long it's gonna take me to open a package, so I figured it's actually easier if I do it pre-recorded so I can fast forward if it takes me a little while. So I don't remember, I might have bought, this feels like a tray, but look how beautifully she bubble wraps. So let me just go ahead and snip that all open. And I'll be right back when I have it open. All right, guys, I am through the bubble wrap and now I am just on the padding. So let's see what this was that I bought. Oh yes, this is cute. It is a little vanity tray. That is cute. Richenbach, Germany. So that is adorable. That I'll probably, and so like when I shop sometimes these like clearance sales and stuff, so I may give this a try on my Etsy shop now. And we'll see, and if not, then I'll end up keeping it for me because it's cute. So on to the next package. And I can see, I think there is a figurine in here. And I believe I may have bought a set of alligator shakers. And these will go in my shaker collection because I am in Florida. And I'm just like, there we go. I'm almost there. I can see the treasure at the end. There we go. There we go. 
Look how cute. So one of these other ones, this guy is probably the mate to this one. So I got this little tiny gator shaker. I just, so cute. So those will go in my salt and pepper shaker collection. I also like the airbrush on. When I get my critters, I like the airbrush finish. So that's that one. And since this one I'm sure is the other one, I'll wait to open that afterwards since you guys already saw one. Then this is light, so this may have been, I think she has some ephemera. So I'm thinking this might have been a postcard or something. She has it nicely protected. And sure enough, Jewel of the Nile. I loved this movie as a kid, so I got this. And that'll be for me. And now we have a little bit, I'm trying to keep the addresses off, a friend mail. Now I know what this is because she messaged me that she found them, but I'm super excited to go ahead and open them. So thank you, Michelle, for thinking of me when you spotted these. I really appreciate it. Oh gosh, girl. Look at the cute little topper she sent. You didn't have to do that, Michelle. You're too sweet, girl. So there's a cute little pencil. Can always use those because I'm always doing my schedules for the month at the start of the month. And then by day three, they're all erased and rearranged. I'm sure you guys know what that's like. Then there's little, I can have a Santa tattoo. There are four piece Santa tattoos, so you know. Saint Nick. <laughs> Michelle's card. Banana split cake. Cute little recipe, aw. Michelle loves her sloths. Sloth rummy, that's so cute. And then some more cute little Christmas tags. So these will be stored away in my ephemera for next year. And then a cute little bow. So cute. And I really love this tissue paper. It's very pretty. So Michelle and a lot of my friends know that I like to collect vintage New York items, souvenirs, or things that remind me of New York. I grew up in New York. I didn't grow up in the city, but just being close to it, I kind of have a nostalgia for historical items from New York. So she saw these when she was out um, after the holidays and she picked them up for me as cute little fillers for like on a tiered tray. So I'm excited to get this open. Trying to be gentle. And they are so cute. Look at that. The little Statue of Liberties. That is so cool, Michelle. I love those. So this one is great for the 4th of July, and I can use this one in a little St. Patty's Day display, and this one's rubber. And that's just super fun to me. So thank you so much, Michelle. I really appreciate the friend mail, and I loved all the items I got from your sale. So guys, if you are not subscribed to Michelle at Newman's Cupboard, we are trying to get her to 1,000 followers. So be sure to head on over to her channel, check her out, and I will be back with you guys soon for more hauls, shop with me's, and just all around vintage shenanigans. See you later.